Land surveys carry out a lot of dilapidation reports um, throughout Australia on most of the major projects. We do office buildings, hospitals, education buildings, roads, laneways, even down to parks. In Canberra, we captured the Australian War Memorial. Sometimes we even have to capture assets such as street signs. It really can be anything, just depending on what the project is for. Dilapidation survey should be carried out at the beginning of a project before any construction work starts, so we get a solid idea of the existing condition of that property or of that asset. And then typically, once construction works have been completed, we'll go back and do a post-condition survey as well. That gives us the comparison to be able to pass into the client. With the DLAT reports, to make sure that they're objective and unbiased, we are always the independent surveyor for our clients. This ensures you know, a fairness between client and perhaps the tenant to make sure that we're not potentially adding in defects or taking away defects so then the tenants can't make a claim. We just go in and it is what it is. We capture what we see. If we don't see it, we don't capture it. And we always just make sure that everything is as is.